Hey, what's up guys, it's Logic here. This is my friend Stacy, looks like a chick. This is Castro, loves to f chicks. We're super excited to go on tour with y'all. It's gonna be amazing. This is the first tour that I've done where, okay, now I'm gonna be a little more serious. So obviously we're going with Juicy J. Juicy J's the man. So it's gonna be Stacy, and then it's gonna be Castro, and then it's gonna be Juicy, and then it's gonna be Logic. And we're just gonna have fun, man. We're gonna do whatever the f we wanna do, dog. My previous video, I was very, I'm like over arenas. I wanna do something, I wanna feel the fans. Not in a weird way though. And I really, I just, I just feel like this is a special time. College Park is a special kind of album. And let me just be real, let me break it down here. I ain't doing no dumbass. It's gonna be me, a microphone, a DJ, straight rap, straight music. That's what it's gonna be. So I thought I'd prepare a little bit of a Q&A with uh, who you can expect to see on tour. What's your name? Uh, my name is Travis Stacy. Okay, cool. Where are you from? Cora Hills, California. What kind of music do you make? Indie rock. What's your name? C. Castro. And where are you from? Maryland. So real talk, how many tours have you been on? It's probably like five. How many tours have you been on? Just the one with you. Final verse. With who? With you and Wiz Khalifa. Okay, but did you perform? Oh, no, I was your assistant. <laughs> exactly, you were my assistant, and now here you are. So it's gonna be crazy, it's just gonna be us going out doing our thing. How do you guys feel? Well, you know what, I'm gonna interview you, I'm gonna interview you guys. I thought that was what you said you were gonna yeah, do. Yeah, but I'm gonna do it more like, uh, like a casting couch vibes. Hey, what's up guys, I'm Logic, and I'm here to introduce you to your openers for the College Park Tour. Ma'am, what's your name? Travis Stacy. And how old are you? 25. And can you turn, can you give me a profile please, baby girl? Chris? Yeah, you look beautiful. What kind of music do you make? Indie rock. Do you enjoy it? I love it, yeah. What's your favorite band? Probably Radiohead. You over there on the left, what's your name? C. Castro. And uh, how old are you? 32. All right, that's what's up. How tall are you? 6'2". Favorite color? Blue. How long have you rapped? Since I was like 16. Just math, how long is that? And four plus two, five, so like 15 years? 16 years, that's 16. the correct answer. <laughs> What's your favorite kind of music? I couldn't tell you, I love all music. And what kind of music do you make? Hip hop, specifically. Why do you think that you should be on this tour? I think I should, I think I should be on this tour because it's gonna be fun, I'm fun. And uh, I love Juicy J, and I love Stacy, and I love Logic, and uh, it's gonna be awesome, and it's with my boys and my family, and uh, yeah. Okay, Stacy, why do you think you should be on this tour? Uh, I think I'm a good time. I think I have some good tunes. What are you, a call girl? I think I'm a good time. <laughs> I'm a good time. Okay, all right, continue. Got some good tunes, maybe, maybe juice up the crowd, change the vibe up a little bit. Juice them up, like they're on the roids, man. Yeah, juice it up for sure. Stacy, what was your first experience that you can remember performing live? Uh, I went to a boarding school, like a behavioral school when I was 15. A behavioral school? Did you have behavior issues? Sometimes, yeah. Like what? I didn't go to, I wouldn't go to school. So the behavior was that you weren't going to school, so they put you in a behavior school. Yeah, where they, you sleep at the school. You so sleep at the school. You can't really skip school. Could you like escape? Uh-huh. You couldn't escape? No, absolutely not. So wait, there was alarms on the door. Was it all boys school or was it girls? No, there was, was co-ed. Oh, a little co-ed action. But uh, I was in a music class and uh, we all had to do performances. So I was 15, it was epic. What'd you do? Uh, I did uh, Hey by the Pixies. Wow, classic. Been trying to meet you. What is your first experience? The first time I ever performed is when I wrote this poem when I was about 14 and it was called How. I first read it to my English teacher and she was like, this is amazing. You need to perform this at like a little talent show poetry jam situation. And I read the poem and I was very nervous. It was the first time I was on stage in front of like probably like the whole, my whole class, like a hundred people plus. And uh, I did it and everybody clapped and there were some people crying. They really touched them. Then I like leave and I'm with my mom and we get into the car. She was like, hmm, you had everyone fooled in there, didn't you? And I was like, what? She was like, you just spat all that bullshit to all those people and had them all crying and all that but I know who you really are. In that moment, I, like, that was a long time ago, but like, I think I just felt not validated or seen or heard. I was hoping that would have made my mom proud because I made like all of these people proud. Can I tell you something? Yeah. Every night you're gonna go out and perform and those people are gonna love you and they're gonna accept you like I accept you and like I love you and like I care about you because you're an amazing person, you're incredibly talented and you deserve everything in the world. I love you and I know for a fact you are not bullshitting anyone. I think the world's gonna really enjoy seeing you on tour because you fucking, you're doing something really special. Thank you bro, I love you too. To you. All right, so, Daisy. 
Mm -hmm. Favorite food? I'd say like chicken taco, solid street taco. Chicken taco, but like from where? A little truck on the side of the street. Any you know? truck? No, good one. I don't have any one where specific. In LA, just LA food trucks are fire. What is the most amount of people you've ever performed in front of? I think a thousand people once. Where? At the Metro in Chicago for my college battle of the bands. How was that experience? It was cool, it was all right. It wasn't, I didn't, it was all right, it wasn't that cool. And Castro, what is the most amount of people you have ever performed in front of? Probably on the Vinylverse tour, 10 plus thousand, probably like New Hampshire was like one of those Arkansas big shows. Arkansas was crazy, too, before the storm, remember? Oh yeah, oh yeah, and then we didn't get to, oh no, I did get you to did perform, that was, yeah, 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 yeah. Bob didn't, Bob didn't get to perform. I was pretty nervous before every show. I don't know, I just wanted to do good. I myself tend to get nervous for the first show or two, and then after that I'm pretty locked in. Yeah, I hadn't been, I hadn't performed in like five years, six years, also we was on tour with Wiz Khalifa and people that I really like looked up to and like DJ Drama and like all of these people, even like 24K and Golden, he has hits and shit, you know? I was looking at that kid too, so it's like I was just wanted to do a good job and impress the crowd and impress the people behind backstage too. Travis Stacy, what are you looking forward to most about this tour? I'm probably just hanging out with everyone again. I really liked that last time. That was probably the best part. Hanging out on the bus is really fun. The hotels are fun. Days off are really fun. Performing is fun too. That'll be good. Are you stoned? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Castro, what are you looking forward to most about this tour? First of all, yeah, kicking it with the boys, kicking it with the homies again, and also connecting with some new fans, getting people to hear my music, and making new fan artist relationships, inspiring people to be themselves. Thousands of people watching this are gonna come see you guys in various states. What do you have to say to those people who are watching you right now? Uh, you should buy Logic College Park merch that's out now on the website. And uh, you should come, what's the question again? <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's great. See you guys on tour.